One of the greatest things that we will learn upon soul traveling or astral traveling beyond the veil is that the cosmos is teeming with familiar and unfamiliar life forms. Many of these life forms are higher and more advanced expressions of their primitive selves that are right here on earth. It is highly likely that every single organic or biological life form on earth has a higher and more advanced versions of self vibrating somewhere within all of creation, be it by way of natural evolution, natural selection, or hybridization programs. From our current understanding and perspective on matters as such, we may classify or define these beings as alien, ETs, demons, gods, falling angels, etc. Irregardless of what we call them or classify them as, they live. Some of these beings clearly have a vested interest in life forms here and or this planet. One of my most recent soul travel experience was the witnessing of the banishment of a wicked wizard. Yes, they too are real. This particular being stood out because I felt that she was the most telepathic. She was at the center of this group's psychic and mental takedown of the very powerful wizard previously mentioned. I will now show my illustration of what she looked like to me. Most notable attributes, large wide belly, huge circular satellite like disc as an extension to her head. By a human standard of measurement, she would stand approximately six feet tall. Remember the revelations and stories that I shared in relation to this little guy about a year ago? For those who are not familiar, the video was published on YouTube May 9th, 2014 and the title is An Interesting Elemental Reveal. Look it up. I didn't know it at the time, but it turns out that this creature is connected to the praying mantis being that I had shown earlier. Can you guess in what way? Share your comments, opinions, and views below.